One tried those who advocated the superiority of the white race. Another won a high-profile case against government employee reality winner who was found guilty of leaking sensitive intelligence information to the media in 2018. With some victories and some major defeats, they pursued the elected officials' allegations of corruption. Arrow right and they helped the notorious drug cartel leaders be thrown behind bars. Private lawyer lawyers, who Jack Smith commissioned to judge ex-president Donald Trump, come from several departments of Ministry of Justice and come together to work full-time on the two most stew cases in country. The other examines President Biden's alleged efforts to reverse the results of the 2020 election. Victory. This case is parallel to a separate state-level investigation in Gough Fulton County. Federal investigations resulted in a total of 44 charges that Trump claimed to be innocent. Trump also. He also did wrong Georgia, where he faced 13 charges at the state level. And in New York, where he faced 34 charges for falsifying job records a state case related to Seuss money payments. During the 2016 election campaign refuses. The Ministry of Justice was reluctant to disclose the names of prosecutors in Smith's team as the increase in threats to them led comprehensive security measures. This is former private consultant Robert S., who, if asked by reporters, confirmed Russia's intervention in the 2016 presidential elections and which prosecutors were investigating possible ties with the Trump campaign, a deviation from the application of Mueller III. Still, as Trump investigations move to the preliminary hearing and more documents requiring prosecutors. Signature are filed in public archives. A clearer picture begins to emerge. According to court files and interviews with people who recognize the private law firm, this effort included at least 40 lawyers, as well as FBI agents and support staff. Some were working on investigation even before Chief Prosecutor Merrick Garland appointed Smith as a private consultant in November. This appointment gives him more independence than the leaders of Ministry of Justice compared to other federal prosecutors. Garland made this decision after Trump officially announced that he would be a third candidate for the White House. Mostly middle and senior career prosecutors do not work in the same place. Some are located in Northeast Washington Office Private Consultant, a satellite office located near Union Station of Ministry Justice. Others work from U.S. lawyers or FBI offices in different states. According to public spending reports that the private counselor should submit every six months. The investigation cost taxpayers more than $5.4 million in terms of salary, equipment and travel between November and April. Prosecutors are currently accused by Trump of being sleazebags and unbalanced on social media and calling for online extremist forums court applications and hearings are closely reviewed.